To quote Hank Williams Jr., interest rates are up and the stock market's down, and you only get mugged if you go downtown. Hi, I'm Scott Jacobs with Jacobs & Company, and look, I'm shooting this video on September 21st, okay? And later this afternoon, the Fed is gonna have yet again another meeting to discuss raising the interest rates. Uh, it seems inevitable that the Fed is undoubtedly gonna increase the interest rates. It remains to be seen, though, if this is gonna look like three quarters of a point and or one full percentage point. I'm shooting this, to educate you as the consumer, because I've been talking to you for a long time that we've really been in a seller's market for a very long time. You own a property, you probably you know gained about 30% in equity appreciation alone. But look, all good things will eventually come to an end and a close, right? And that's not to say that the market's gonna do what it did back in 2008, but what you need to understand is, when interest rates go up another three quarters of a point, another full percentage point, right? That doesn't have a direct correlation with mortgage rates, but it does have some impact. So imagine with me, if you will, that interest rates now on a 30 year fixed rate mortgage look like 7%, okay? Well, what impact does that have? Let's just say that you buy a million dollar home for round numbers. You finance, you put down 20%, you finance 800,000. The difference between six and 7% could literally mean $1,500 to $2,000 additional in your monthly payment, right? That's typically people's fund money. That's their disposable income. When your disposable income gets eaten away at, that's where people come up with the quote, you're house poor. Who wants to be house poor today, right? We work so hard in this Northern Virginia marketplace, large in part, dual income households, people putting in 40 plus hours a week, right? Just to get home, get you know Johnny and Susie off to their practices or their games and their sporting events, all to wake up and do it again the next day. When we actually want to you know, have that family time or time with our friends, you need that disposable income. This really has impacts across the board on people. You know, I've been shooting these videos for a long time, doing whatever I can to just get you on the right side of the fence. And it's not just because, you know, hey, Scott Jacobs or Jacobs and Company agents are just out to get another listing. It's really not about that. What we want to do is be an advocate for you, right? And educate you on the marketplace because I believe for you all at home that watch this video that take heed to my advice, our advice here at Jacobs and Company to get off the fence and actually you know, get your home onto the market immediately. It's gonna be the best decision you ever made. You will actually be able to capitalize towards the high end of the market. Where, when was the actual peak of this run? Probably three or four months back, okay? So we are on the other side of the equation, but it's still a seller's market. But price reductions are becoming much more prevalent, right? So over 35% of listings, you know, in our area, when I say our area throughout Northern Virginia, we are receiving price reductions on properties that were egregiously priced, you know what I mean? And you could do that three, four months ago. Now you can't do that anymore. For me personally, you know, all signs point to once we get beyond November of this year, you know, uh, the Fed is gonna be a little bit less interested in keeping things propped up, which means that maybe some financial pain starts to set in in 2023. Don't be a part of that. You know, be proactive today. Um, get together with one of our talented agents today for a independent, free, no obligation consultation to educate you on what the fair market value of your home is today, right? Why we're still in 2022. I just know that once we get into 2023, the picture is gonna look a little bit more bleak for you. So if you have any questions, I hope that you'll certainly shoot us a message or you'll give us a call better yet at the office, 703 area code 594-3800. Do not delay, the time is now. Thank you so much.